So Team Fortress 2 went through some rough stuff in the past year, but do not worry, Face It is here to save the day. Not really. While the big pro of Face It is that there are no bots, the cons are eh, kinda big as well. Let us first go through the pros of Face It. The biggest pro is kind of the only thing new players to face it focus on, no bots. This adds several more steps to the gateway of a perfect game, although there is more than just no bots. Two mechanics that are frustrating as hell in casual mode have been removed from face it servers, auto balance and random crits. Random crits and auto balance are mechanics made straight from hell. Seeing a game have no bots? No auto balance and no random crits seems like the perfect game, but there are some cons that ruin the concept of this. While the pros make face it feel perfect, there are some cons that stop it from becoming, well, perfect. There is something that casual has that face it does not. Can you guess what it is? What the hell? Welcome to face it! Yeah, skilled based matchmaking. Sure, no bots is more fun, but when it comes to bad skill based matchmaking, it can sort of ruin the fun out of the game. You can't put a more recent player oh, hey. up against God himself. It just isn't fair and, well, balanced. This infuriates newcomers, leading them to just keep getting steamrolled. Along with this matchmaking, the vote kick system is kinda strange especially when it comes to the queue of ban time. So when you have a heavy with like three pocket medic spawn camping, it isn't as easy to get rid of him than it is in casual. Darn. Anyways, I highly doubt Face It wouldn't fix the cons when Face It TF2 is out of beta. Along with that, a lot of people on Face It are really nice. So I would recommend Face It as long as you really don't care about skill level.